All right, I am going to show you how to import songs and skins into Uso. So, first of all, we are just going to go to the USO website, login, blah, blah, blah. And along the top here, you have beat maps. And just click on beat map. Beat maps. Ugh. Can I do this? And you have a list of songs and blah, blah, blah. You know, they have that search engine up here and stuff. So, we're just going to pick a song here. Yeah, you notice if you click on these, you can, um, it'll give you a little preview of it. Well, most of them will, anyways. I'm trying to find a good song. <laughs> okay, we'll just do this in prison. And as you click on it, you notice you don't really have to click on it. If you want to know more about it, you can click on it. But if you just want to download it, then... You just, you know, here it is. And you click download. You want to save the file. And, you know, save it anywhere, documents. I have a, usually have a place um, that I have a folder that I've named Uso Bmaps. And this is where I save them to. So just let that save. We'll just go to bring up Uso and also bring up the folder, you know, like a separate place for your folder thingy. Well, you know, bring it up. Okay, I'm just pausing the music there. So, you don't really have to like go into here to import your song. So you just bring up uh, your Windows Explorer, not Internet Explorer, Windows Explorer, and you find your file, and you simply drag it onto here. Notice it says you're being the pro the uh, the song was being imported, and now you have it here. It's right there. Yep. And. Now we talk skins. You're going to go here to options in the menu screen. And right here where it says skin, you'll click here. I have a different number of skins right here. They usually just change, you know, the stuff. Um, uh, they change the style. And this can really help because... I find it as some of these actually help me get a better score than most others. I don't know, it's just, you know, some of them are, it's usually, and usually you can say get more skins, but they only give you a limited um, options you can choose from, and they're usually not that good. So, we want to get more skins. and. Importing skins are a very complicated matter. Well, it can be made into a very easy matter. We just go back to website. And where it says community, we go to forums. I like to go to the place right here under Uso, it says skinning, it's usually where I click. And then, usually you'll find a lot of stuff here, like Kingdom Hearts skin, and stuff like that, you know, Kantuko skin, Mirani skin, blah 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 skin. <laughs> so, there's a lot of different places you can go to get a skin, but we will pick a skin here, so just for the sake of 
Um, let's see. Let's do Kagame, Lin, and Rinskin. Usually people will give you a little, like here, they'll give you a little picture of what it'll look like. Mm, this doesn't look like really one that I would do, but... Okay, but yeah, basically this style is different. And I think that really encourage you to, you know, do one. So, some of these files will already be, because in the OSK file, or OSK file, I just like to call it OSK. Anyway, OSK file. To import it into USO, it has to be in an OSK file, or else it just won't work. Some of these will already be in an OSK file. Anyway, most of them will already be, you know, that. Oh man. Okay, it looks like this one's obviously not. Go to a different thing they have provided for us. Okay. Most of these files, as you first get them, though, I mean, some of them are in OSK file, and you're pretty lucky if the person has converted it already. But most of them will be in their different files, RAR file. Download this. Save it um, to some place. I usually like to save it to my desktop so that I know where it is and I can easily convert it. So I like to save it to my desktop. Almost done. Okay. Okay. So now that it is, I'm gonna find it. Yeah, okay. Right here. It's in your RAR file. You want to download WinRAR or WinZip. I prefer WinRAR, but sometimes you need to have zip files. But WinRAR. Download WinRAR. It's completely free. I'm pretty sure. Or at least I have it for free anyways. Just go there and say download a uh, WinRAR. Yeah, you, you have to have WinRAR or some sort of converting file or else you're not going to be able to convert this. So we have WinRAR. Just look that up. Download it. And you can get to converting. And the way we convert this, we want to extract the files first. Now, I have to tell you, um, you, there may be some corrupt skins that you'll get, whereas you extract the files, I like to extract them to my desktop. Well, you extract them and everything in it just goes all over your page. And, like, I downloaded one and it just went everywhere. Like, everything inside of it was all over my desktop and I had to go and delete them all. It was not fun and that one ended up not working, so... Just want to be careful so you don't keep on trying to make it work when it's not going to work. So you want to extract the files. Desktop, which is what I'm doing. Now, after you have extracted the files, you cannot simply place this into USO just yet. They're not finished. No. You click this and you want to add to the archive. Add it to the archive. This is very important that you, right here, the archive format, you hit zip. It needs to be in zip. This is very important. You do not put it in zip, it's not going to work. And you want to rename it, the end part where it says dot zip, you want to make it dot o s k. And do not try to rename it and then click zip, because that's not going to work. It's just, it'll go backwards and yeah. So, click zip first and then rename it, rename the end OSK. Don't change anything else. It's good this way. So, 
we press OK. And now we have this OSK file. Obviously looks USO type. Obviously. So we just have it here. You bring up your USO game. And you have to click in skins, I'm quite positive. Or at least that's the way I do it. And you simply take it from your desktop, drag it right into here. And as we know that was Ren and Lynn. Oh here we go. Got me to it. And this is it. Which I will use it just for Now it's all like Kagame Rin and Lin Fide. Oh my gosh. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh, well, this one isn't. Because it's like Sam. But anyway, yeah. So, you see, we have Rin and. Or, ugh. Rin and Len. <laughs> so, yeah, they're there, though. So each different skin you get, you know, it's a different thing. And when you finish each level, you know, just different styles. It really helps to. I have a nice star mouse now. So yes, that is how you do it. Oh my god, how do I get this to stop recording? I'm not stopping. But there you have it, so 